The new revenue recognition standard is a joint standard issued by the FASB and the ISB, and it's going to replace all existing US GAAP and IFRS literature on revenue recognition. The new standard has a five-step model uh, to walk through how you recognize revenue. The first step is identify the contract with the customer. The second step is to identify the performance obligation, so the goods or services to be delivered to the customer. The third step is to determine the transaction price, which basically means how much you're going to get paid for those goods and services. The fourth step in the model is to allocate that total contract value between the goods and services that will be delivered. And then the fifth step is to recognize revenue as you deliver the goods and services. So on the face of it, the model seems relatively straightforward and I think many companies would say that looks pretty similar to what I do today. Um, I think in reality though, as you drill down into the detail in each of those steps, there's a lot of nuances and subtleties that technology companies are really going to have to think through carefully uh, because the devil's in the detail. Many of our technology clients have already realized that the new standard's going to make some pervasive changes for, for their accounting but also for their business. We've already started working with a number of companies that uh, got moving on this early. PwC is here and ready to support our clients in their implementation efforts today.